The new Malibu will be sold all over the world. Uh, so we had an opportunity to, to style this vehicle so that it would appeal to a broad range of people. So we knew we had to really reach on this new design. We wanted to make it more athletic, uh, more aggressive, and appeal to uh, people in that way. We wanted this car to look relaxed a bit, fun to drive, let the hair down a little bit. When you start a design, we always start sketching. The most important thing is the proportion. And then you get into the theme. Do you have three or five lines that really define what the theme is? We borrow some of the cues and DNA from our uh, performance vehicles, Camaro and Corvette. It looks good even when it's sitting in your driveway. The most beautiful sketch still needs to come off the paper and become 3D surfaces. As designers, if we create the appropriate vision, people will be sold on it. We've really tried to focus on strong wheel-oriented forms. We've added width to the car. It really plants the vehicle on the ground and also will help for handling. The added width really allowed us to play up these broad shoulders. It makes the car really striking when you see it. We've added dynamic surfacing to the hood and the deck lid that allow it to catch light and show reflections in an exciting way. To see more, you'll need to watch the global premiere of the all-new Chevrolet Malibu live on Monday, April 18th at 8.30 p.m. Eastern Time on Chevrolet's Facebook page or Tuesday, April 19th if you're in Shanghai. For even more news on the Malibu, check out the New York Auto Show on April 20th. I'm Dan Gifford, lead exterior designer for the Malibu.